welcome to Dude RV. Hey, I really appreciate you stopping by. And of course, as usual, they got here just in time. That's right, just in time for another virtual tour of, of a state park. But I'm not in Texas. I have traveled west to the Bottomless Lakes State Park, New Mexico. Of course, you already knew that from up there. But it wouldn't be as dramatic if I didn't say it in a dramatic fashion. It is so dramatic. I have the Valkyrie. We are gonna go ride, and man, it's gonna be it's gonna be a ride down a hill. So let's let's gear up. Let's put on some safety gear. All right, safety gear in place. Now, I tightened up my brakes before this ride, so. using too much battery.
big loop first and then we'll swing back out on this road to get to the RV camping loop now there there is a trail that cuts between the two and I will have a trail ride video for that it wasn't very long probably 10 minutes So these weird looking formations are the collapse. So the bottomless lakes are actually cenotes, which is where a cave collapses and leaves a hole full of water. So there's a, a lot of cenotes in Mexico, Central America, they were holy places for the Incas and the Aztecs. These are really fascinating. Like this one, there's two side by side. One's got too much salt for fish, the other one doesn't. And it looks like they're the same cave. How does that work? primitive with vault toilets. If you want flushing toilets, you got to go to the RV area. I think there's all told six cenotes.
bottomless. I think Leah Lake is something like a hundred feet thereabout. shown up since I started my bike ride. A lot more cars here now than there were. Of course, it's Friday afternoon and everybody's probably getting off work. We're going to go down here to the end and turn around and come back on the walkway. Provided someone doesn't tell us we can't do that. Be bumpy. This park was originally constructed by the Civilian Conservation Corps. I think I mentioned that. If I didn't, I just did. Now you know. If you're going to swim out here, you're going to have any kind of flotation, kayak, paddleboard, whatever. They require you to have a life jacket. It is not optional. They think I'm the Google Maps guy. They don't know who Dude RV is. go look at the RV camping loop. And we're going to take a little shortcut. Cruise past the tower that's inaccessible because of cracks. I guess it's cracks. It's got big cracks in the top anyway. sites over here as well. These are all pull throughs. I'll do, I'll do a, I'll come back on this. I know y'all are saying, well, dude, we can't see you in the site. So I'll, I'll make it right. Trust me. The tent sites back here actually have power and water.
able to do this on a sable a scooter. Well, I could, but it would be really, really rough. Come back and do a shower check too. I have yet to do the new derby shower check. I see some some fights on the back side of the restroom facility, so we'll cruise back there. Definitely something to be said uh, about the advantages of pavement versus gravel for a campground road surface. I know, I know, we still have to go back the other way on the other side. We'll go down here and do a UE and come back. Because that's, that's the last site. So we'll, we'll, we'll turn around. You uh, three Insta 360 folks, the VR observers. Be patient. I enjoyed it. Just look at this. Let's look how cool that is. This is our campsite. If you enjoyed our little ride through Bottomless Lake State Park, New Mexico, please click on that thumbs up and blast me out across your social media. If you've not already, I'd be most honored if you'd consider clicking on that subscribe button. And for those of you who have subscribed, thank you. That's why I get to do what I do. And for my patrons, I am so grateful for your generosity. You guys rock! All right, y'all come back now, you hear?